Have you ever wondered why you can't seem to follow through on certain tasks or why you're avoiding others? Resolutions, projects, programs sometimes are not implemented or they're not followed through because you aren't inspired. Stay tuned to find out how to increase the chances of you sticking to those resolutions. Welcome to this episode of Your Personal Wordsmith, tips to communicate with clarity and impact with public speaking and communications expert, Lillian Zarzar. How many times have you started a program, a project, or decided that you are going to implement a new resolution only to find you are becoming less motivated over time? You may be overwhelmed. The tasks are daunting, or you just don't know where to start. I have an idea for you. One of the reasons is because your decision was probably made in an effort to force yourself into doing something you really didn't want to do, and yet you felt you ought to do it. Task lists are necessary for implementation to achieve your goals. Granted, there are some tasks you may not enjoy doing, and yet they are required for completing your project. So here's a simple concept to put into place. Link each of your tasks to your highest values. For example, if you value communicating effectively, create scripts to address those issues so in an important meeting, you can speak with confidence and much greater certainty. While it is a chore to jot down lines and lists, that preparation relieves the stress of thinking on your feet and knowing what to say an hour later. Consider these three concepts and three tips that will help you. First, identify your values. Clarify what is most important to you so that you can visualize your success. Be very specific and clear about your values, whether you want to be an effective leader, a better parent, a more well-rounded person, Understand what these concepts mean to you and figure out what you perceive it would take to be all those things. Once you know what your highest values are, the easier it is to make a list of those tasks to achieve those goals. Dr. John Demartini, who is a mentor of mine, is a human development specialist. He says, your life demonstrates your values. How do you live your life? Second, chunk all those tasks into achievable pieces. You say you want to communicate better? Well, look for a communication coach. That would be me. Or take a course at a local university. Or join a mastermind group, better yet create your own, to discuss communication concepts and to share best practices. In other words, if something is important enough to you, you do whatever it takes to make it happen, don't you? List every task you implement to reach that goal. Each of these tasks is simply making a choice at each step. So as you accomplish one task at a time, you whittle away at the list. And third is choose. Yes, that's what I said. That's simply choose. Every decision you make is a choice. Do you choose to do what it takes to achieve your goals and live your highest values? Or do you choose not to implement the strategies because it just takes too much time or you don't want to work that hard? then what you think you should be doing is not a high enough value for you. Remember, as Dr. Demartini said, you make your choices on the basis of the hierarchy of your values. So what choices are you making every day? Are you regretting a choice? Then make another choice. You can uncover your highest values and make more effective choices, and I can help you get there. I can assist you when you contact me at www.zarzargroup.com for a complimentary consultation. And let's get those tasks done and communicate better. Thank you for watching your personal wordsmith. For more great information, visit lillianzarzar.com. Also browse the other shows found right here at Columbus Biz TV Shows.